Welcome to Greenie's Garden. Are you playing in the dirt? Are you playing in the dirt? <laughs> no, then why is your nose brown? <laughs> huh? <laughs> it wasn't like that before. <laughs> <laughs> You're so awesome. You're a good girl. Hey, what's up, Green Army? It's Brandon and Alyssa. Hey, guys. And we hope all of you guys are having an awesome day today. I feel so relaxed right now because we're in the backyard, and it's seriously, guys, my favorite vacation spot. Yep, mine too. Open the back door, and it's so nice to just hang out here to get food and just relax. But we wanted to show you guys a couple cool things in our backyard here. One is we got a new friend, and we found our first nest. Yeah, our trees are <laughs> finally big enough. I know. I'm super excited because to me that means what? That the birds are comfortable enough to nest here. Yeah. So I'm really excited. I'm not trying to freak around because she's staring me down right now. Can you see her? If you look right to that, the, the trellis part. No. No, you can't see her. She's up there. Well, you're beautiful anyway, so we're going to leave her alone. Maybe one day we can show you guys a baby bird. So anyway, we wanted to show you some other friends, guys. If you know us, we love Mother Nature, we love animals, so we wanted to show you some more of our friends. So we're gonna show you the caterpillars today. We planted a tropical milkweed. Uh -huh. uh, when did we plant this one? Like the fall? Mm -hmm. I think so. So probably in the fall we planted this tropical milkweed. It's super beautiful. Um, can, we, can we show them? Yeah, let's All check right. this I out. Kind of, I'm like too excited. Look at Greenie, she's like ready. All right, Greenie, let's show them right here. So this is the tropical milkweed. So if you ever look at these leaves, you're gonna wonder like, hey, something's eating the leaves on here. Like look, it's just gone. This is what they usually look like right here. So something's wrong, right? Not necessarily because we're willing to give this tree to our friends here, because check this out. Look who's hanging out right here, babe. Look at him. What's up, dude? These are our monarch caterpillars. Check this guy out. Can you see it? Sorry, dude, I don't want to interrupt you too much. And it looks like he is leaving us some compost right where my index finger is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> caterpillar poops. So these are our monarchs, and they migrate every year. And they like to eat milkweed. So we planted one, hoping that we'd be able to give them some food. Right. And they totally love it. Seriously, it's... You pay a lot of attention to this area. It's so cool because you like teach me about all the milk, like the milkweed itself. Because every time you always talk about this spot. Yeah, this is like one of my favorite plants. Right. We had like, we had at one point we had 20 caterpillars on there. Right. And last time we checked there were only five. But, but birds don't eat them because they're really bitter. Right. So we were looking around and we found something else really cool we have to show you. So now that you guys have seen the tropical milkweed right here. We have to show you another spot that they've been going to to hang out. So let's go check it out, guys. All right, so now I'm stuck between two trees right now. The mango tree and the bamboo. You guys know us, we love this bamboo tree. It takes care of so many trees for us back here. But not only trees, guys, there's another caterpillar. So can we show them this one real quick, Ben? Yeah, we started noticing caterpillars in our bamboo, which we thought was weird. Look at him. He stopped once he noticed we started watching him. Or her. So not only did we find a caterpillar, but we found Mother Nature's hammock for these guys. Check this out. This is a cocoon right here, guys. If you look very closely, where did it go? You can see it. Can you see it? <laughs> <laughs> it's right here. <laughs> it's so hard to see. I had to focus on too. Anyways, there's a cocoon there, and... There is another one, I promise we found it. They're only a few inches apart from each other. Oh, right there. Oh yeah, good eye. It's so cool, guys, because this backyard is not only for us, but it's for, as you guys can see, the caterpillars. Um, we see a lot of hummingbirds back here. Lizards. Lizards, uh, just bugs, worms. Toads. I mean, yeah, am I missing anything? Like, I'm prob I probably am because it's been so cool how much wildlife has come to our yard from just planting trees. Not just edible trees, you know, some things just for beauty or for the caterpillars or to build a microclimate. You know, just really be open-minded to, it's your garden. If you want it to be lush, throw in as many trees as you want, guys. 
if you have ground, you have space is what I try to say. So, um, thank you guys so much for checking out all of our cool friends in our backyard. Guys, as always, we hope all of you have an awesome day today. Bye, guys. All right, guys, so now it's like almost, what, two weeks? And we wanted to show you guys our new friend here. Welcome to life. Check it out.